Hey everyone, this is Blackbinder, and welcome back to the Blind Let's Play of Dark Souls 3. Last time we left off, we had tried and failed to kill the Dark Dragon Medir, and I've been going through him. I actually ran another guy up just to fight him, because I don't think blunt we weapons do very good damage on him, and I couldn't get him to bleed. So I ran up a new, uh, a new guy, a Faith Strength build, and we're going to use him to fight Medir. But uh, it's going to take some more practice, so I'm just going to finish the game with this guy, and then Madeir will be like an added on last episode, minus what we, the video I already did on him. So we are going to talk to this lady. I'm pretty sure she's going to be the last boss, or she's going to teleport us to the last boss, at least of this DLC. This is Princess Filianor, I believe. Oh, shouldn't have touched the egg. She's not looking too healthy. I didn't do it. <laughs> God, I love that thrall hood. It looks so cool. Make me look like a black mage or something. Yep, she's teleporting me somewhere. But where? And giant big boss. I wonder who the ringed city boss will be. The ringed city, it can't be the furtive pygmy because I, can, I think Manus was kind of supposed to be him from Dark Souls 1. Oh well. Where are we now? Everything's ash. That's not good. We really are at the end of the world now. There's barely anything left to burn. Except for us. <laughs> Wait, what is this? I can go out here, or I can go out here. I'm gonna go out here first. This is just uh, where we came in, really. But let's see if it goes anywhere. Nope. There used to be an entire castle right there. Or not, not really a castle, but like a group of big stone buildings. Okay, we are going to follow the right wall. Hold on. I see something. Oh, Filianor. Help me, please. The Red Hood is come to eat us. The Red Hood, Robin? Dark souls. You've got a Dark Soul? Ah, I want to kill him, but I can't. He's too pathetic. Just going to follow the wall around. Maybe we'll make it up to that city up there. Is this place I'm trying to place it like I'm trying to see if this reminds me of any area before this went all to ash but I don't I can't tell this kind of looks like a boss area too I've searched for thee dark stricken creature I am Shira daughter of the Duke descendant of gods and trusted friend to Medea at once, I am the honor of the gods, the glory of fire, and the fear of the dark. Thou shalt not go unpunished. What did I do? Thy treachery, thy profanity, and thy shameless yearning. I didn't do anything. I think this is the lady who wanted us to kill Medir. Ow. It really hurts. All right. I think she's done talking. Let's let's see if I can beat her. 
Stop doing that. Just give me a second. Okay, now we can heal. Ow. What is that thing? Oh, gotcha. She doesn't run into us like other other uh, hunters or NPC like humans. Remember this. Oh, what the hell? Creature, now will I forgive thy kind. Well, that didn't work out too well, but that's okay. We'll get her this time. Looks like I've only got to hit her three or four times, so. We will do both. Now, deep protection, I guess, actually gives you stamina regain. I didn't I didn't know that. I wonder if it says it in the spell. Maybe I knew it at one time. Yep, stamina recovery. Nice. I thought it was good, but over time, I guess it's just hard to tell because it's a little buff in everything. All right, mister. I've actually run up two guys since the last video. One of them was a hollow bleed build, and then I realized they uh, they freaking nerfed it. So then I built brought up a strength faith strength thee. faith build, Dark, mostly just faith. Creature. I'm going to use the Lothric Knight great sword. At thou shalt for thy Well, that was easy. Never would I ever forgive thy lowly kind. Maybe she's mad at us because we didn't actually kill Medir. Crucifix of the Mad King and a, another Titanite slab. I don't think uh, we'll we'll have to do her fight again on my other character that has beaten Medir or that will beat Medir. I haven't beaten him yet. A cross spear hung with a malformed corpse. Once a mad king was born to the pygmy royalty, and Shira, knight of Filianor, put him to rest. But Shira's cross spear, unable to kill the undying king, only pinned, its, pinned itself to him. Shira delivered them together to a dark room where she stayed and held them close. A mad king's folly. Slam malformed, corp, malformed corpse into the ground to briefly awaken it, then fillet with strong attack to trigger a roar, blessing, or vexation. So... Huh. See that those bones on there? I guess they can't die, so she just kept it on her spear the whole time. All right, we're out of focus points, so it's a well. Let's we didn't even look what it scales with and everything. Uh, D, E, and D with faith and intelligence and strength. Uh, it's a dark damage weapon, so it can't be that bad, but uh, I think we're set on what we're going to use. We're going to keep going around to the right. This is almost as bad as the Kiln of the First Flame from Dark Souls 1. Like it's almost that messed up. All burnt and everything. Anything over here? Probably a whole lot of nothing, but I'm checking anyway. It'd be weird why they would have such a huge open space unless we're going to fight mid -year again. No, because they called him the Red Hood. The only person I can think of with the Red Hood is Gale, but he's been helping us this entire time, so I don't know why he would attack us now. Come on, where are we going? Is there anything over there? No. Whole lot of nothing. Can't believe they didn't even put any like crappy items over here. Look, there's nothing we can do over there either. 
My guy's almost made it to Filianor. <laughs> Can you see him all the, way, all the way in the background? That crawling dude. Hate to break it to you, dude, but she does not look so good. Oh, no. It's a lot of dead people. Oh, I'm curious how they survived when this place is all ash for this long anyway. He's obviously not the boss. Oh, there he, there's the red hood. It's obviously, well, I don't know. He's just eating him. What still here? Should have known not to trust Hand you. It over that thing, your dark soul. I don't understand. For my lady's painting. He wants the dark soul for the painting, I guess? Because what's her name wanted pigment for the for the painting, but I don't know why she wants the dark soul. Whoa, no. Ah! Well, it gives us enough time to heal, maybe. Holy cow. He staggers, so... God. It's flipping around all over the place, though. Whoa, he is fast. But I fought the Nameless King, so I'm not too worried about it. Got to get used to his uh, movements again. Like the Nameless King, I mean. What are you doing? Oh god. Oh god, what are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Damn it. I almost dodged it. Oh wow. This is hurting. There we go. Back up to almost full anyway. We'll have to go over our equipment again before we face him again. There's no way I'm going to beat him this time. Can you break through the walls? No, you can't. All right, so we could cheese him if we wanted to. By staying around the wall and whenever we need to heal, just go around the corner, but we won't do that yet. Damn it! I need to wait to roll when he jumps up like that, or else it's gonna hit me every time. That was lucky. Damn it! Alright, phase two. What's he going to turn into now? Black blood? Well, black-ish. Ah, is this the blood? The blood of the dark soul. Oh, that's the name of the game. Ah. Your sword's not looking too healthy, Gale. And why did you help us just to betray us? What is on your back? Nope, we're out of focus points. 
What is this? Same thing? Kind of the same thing, I guess. Oh, that's the way of the white thingy. Is it gonna come back too? <laughs> it does come back. So we'll, we'll have to watch out for that. Ah! It's got an Avalyn on steroids. All right, well, that didn't work out so hot. Um, I need to look at my equipment and change it around, I think. Okay, what do we got? Havel's ring, why do we have Havel's ring on? Because... Actually, let's see if we can bleed him with the spiked mace. Where are you? Right above it. We'll take a little bit of a, a damage hit, but that's okay if it actually works on him. Plus, we can switch this out with something else. What do we want? We'll go with that tentatively for now. Uh, the Ring of Steel Protection, because it looks like most of his stuff is physical. I don't think our HP is going to be full for very long in this fight, so... We may do Karthus Blood Ring, but I want to stay away from that if I don't have to, because I think that'll get me one shot if I'm not careful. All right, I think that's good for now. What I also want to do is see if we can put on some heavier armor. Where's my cool guy armor? Nope, too heavy. What are we at now? I can put another 7% on, so... We'll go Mira's stuff. No, not those, because they're heavier and worse versus slashing, so. That too is worse. Actually, was this worse? No. So that's good. <laughs> That's better, funnily enough. The Shadow Mask. It's crazy we can't find something better for... We got 3% to work with before we're over encumbered. That one is better. Alright, I think we are good here. Yep. Okay. Well, that's what we're going to go with for now. Kind of looks dumb, but at least from the back, it's not so bad. Oh, looks like we're right in the fight from the beginning now. Good thing we went to the right first. All right. We made it past the first phase fairly easily. So let's see if we can do it again. Now watch for bleeding. We know he can bleed. We saw him bleed before the fight. Holy cow. Come on, heal. There we go. Okay, I don't think we're going to be able to bleed him, at least not with Karthus Rouge. So we'll have to try that. Oh, we... Nope, never mind. I thought we staggered him. Like for an actual critical attack. hi -ya!
Haha, <laughs> hit you. Oh god. That's a thing. Good thing he screams when he does that, or I would be screwed. Can you imagine if he just did that from, like, without a buildup? Look at his cloak. It's like he's got faces in the back, I think. Alright. We don't need to watch this again, but I was taking a drink. Where are you? Bringing us all the way up here, huh? I wish I knew what this place was. I would say it kind of looks like the Lord of Cinder's place, but it's not. Like with all the seats. Okay, we need to get away from those. Where did they come from? Ah! Nope. Okay, there's a second part to that attack. Parthas Rouge. Get away before they come back. Damn it. Thought I was running. That was lucky of me. What is he doing? Get away, get away, get away. He still gets staggered. That's so weird. But I'm obviously not bleeding him, so we'll have to switch to a different weapon after this. Blunt doesn't seem to be doing very good. What is he doing? What are those? What is that? Oh crap. How many more powers are you gonna get, Gale? You can't just do that the whole time. I'll never be able to hit you. Every three hits, I think it staggers him a little bit, so I can trade with him on that third hit. Damn it! The cloak got me. All right, I will be cutting these out until I get uh, a kill, and then I'll show the last fight. All right? See how you like these things. Oh, wow, we got them in two hits that time. But they are very, very slow, so I don't know how well they're actually going to work how well they will actually do oh wow we get a full two staggers with a full stamina bar and a dual wielding ring to knight great swords that's awesome Kind of hard to pull off though, especially as he gets faster. But he has, he seems to have a hard time tracking us when we're doing that, so. Uh, you know what? I think I might actually use these. They're doing pretty well. Whoopsie, I did not have enough stamina to do the jump attack. I was hoping it would hit him. Ha <laughs> ha I ducked under it, that was awesome. Alright, this is the, uh, this is the part that matters though. Will it work against his quicker phase? Seems to be doing okay. Ouch. I cannot poise through that second attack. Ah! I thought the chair would uh, block it. It did not. Go! Damn it. Need to get out of here before those come back. Go! I think if I can bait that attack, I'll, I can, uh, that one where he jumps and charges. 
because it's pretty easy to dodge, and then I get uh, room to attack him after that. But then, this is what I'm worried about, is he just going to keep shooting stuff at me. No! Ah! Couldn't stop him. How do I know where those lightning bolts are going to hit? Are they just following him, maybe? There we go. That's what I want. Or maybe not. Whoops. <laughs> okay. We are going to go ham with these Ring to Night swords and just uh, reallocate our stats based solely upon those swords. <clears throat> Alright, what we are doing here, we are going to talk to Rosaria and... Why are you in here? Hazel Pick and Xanthus Crown. What is that? Hazel pick. Choice weapon of yellow finger hazel. Hazel. Yeah, it's hazel, I'm pretty sure. A finger of Rosaria and Xanth Xanthus Scholar. This is both a weapon and a sorcery staff. The gold specs are remnants of lost sorceries. Steady chant for a short moment. Boost the strength of sorceries. It's got a spell buff of 60, though. That's terrible. Maybe it's just because of my stats, though. Alright. What we're doing here is... Ooh, I like that. That's fast. We are going to redo our stats to work solely based on these. So we want uh, C and D. We want strength and dexterity, I think, first. So well, I first want to look at what it takes to do deep protection and lightning blade. Ah, crap. I need 30 for that. But it doesn't work with this, so I'm not going to I'm not gonna use it. We need 20 faith for deep protection. So we'll just do that. I want to talk to you. Hopefully I have a pale tongue. Can do it five more times in this game. Alright, what we're going to do first, Vigor, definitely want that back up to 35. Endurance, 22, so we can get the attack. Well, hold on. We might get that higher, we might not. Strength, I want to bring it all the way up to, let's see, what are we getting with it? Cancel Rebirth. Hold on. I don't have the right weapon in my hand, so it's hard to tell. Alright, first thing we want to do is check the stamina requirements. We can do this. I think we can do the full... Yeah. We can do the full whatever. The full combo. So we don't actually need 22 Endurance. We could probably take it down 2. Yeah, we can take down Endurance 2 at least. Let's do that. Faith, good. Vitality. Or not vitality, but... Is it vitality? Whichever one uh, does our equip or weight is the one I'm curious about. Okay, we're, we're getting three per stat here. So let's take it up to 40. Three damage per stat. But now we're getting like barely any. Why? Right weapon one. Oh, it's because we don't have enough stats to actually use it. There we go. Okay. So, from here we get one. Let's bring this up to 20. That's what we want for that. Intelligence, we don't need that anymore because we got Orbeck in our place. Can bring this up to 20. Vitality, I don't know what we're going to do with that. Let's bring this up to 30 for now. Alright, how many points we got? About 20, 30 points to work with. So, we get one one attack for that and two for this. So, we're going to we're gonna do two, I think. Well, let's go by fives. One, two, three, four, five. That brings us up to 567. And this one, two, three, four, five. That only gets us 61. So... We are losing out by not going more dexterity for now because it's lower, I'm guessing. All right, let's do five again. Wait, what was it at? 18? One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so we're at 567. Go up five more. 578. 
we need to beat 578 with 48. Okay, so still dexterity is getting us more damage. We want to go to 28. All right, so let's go up five again. 588. Say, okay, so still we're getting more with that. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, it doesn't it doesn't look like it scales at all off of uh, faith. I thought it did. Maybe it just had a faith requirement. I don't know. All right, so one, two, three, four, five. Let's watch again. One, two, three, four, five. Gets us up to five ninety five. One, two, three, four, five. Five ninety seven. So is this a dexterity weapon? I could have swore it was better with strength. C and D is what I thought it was. Oh well, doesn't matter. That's why we're doing this. One, two, three, four, five gets us up to six oh four. It could be just because strength is over over forty three or over forty. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so let's just go one, two, up to six hundred, one, two, up to six hundred. So we're gonna leave dexterity at forty. We're gonna go uh bring that back up to five thirty five, I think. And this is the problem. Let's just go nine for now. Because we have Havel's ring, we have to wear it regardless. And even then, we're not getting the equipment that we want. So, what I want to do is, let's just put on all of our little stuff that we can work with for now. 71. Okay. Nope, that is still not good. Hmm. Trying to think what I want to do. I need just a little bit more equip weight, equip weight, but we'll just have to put on some smaller uh, gloves and pants. Shadow gauntlets, that'll work. Wonder if these shadow pants are any good. They're actually not bad. 4.2, 5.1, so we're losing one full point of defense. What about first is slash? Oh, it's even worse. So no, we can't do that. This is actually better and lighter. So let's go with that then. What are we at now? We are under the weight requirement. Let's see if we can go back up. No, we can't. Oh well, this is good for now. So now, we've got 322 to 257, much better than it was before. Before we, were, we weren't even out damaging this spiked mace with this. I was just doing it because it was cool. <laughs> nice. Obviously these guys aren't a very good uh, judge of how much damage I'm gonna do. So, we can go back now. All right, I will uh, I will cut this part out. Bring it on, Gale, you darn beast. What were you doing about 1250 for a full combo last time? So I need to get a full combo before we take him into the second phase. Oh god, no! Run away! Run away! Run away! Run away! Run away! Come on, quit doing that. I want to see how much my full damage combo hits you for. What are you doing? Nope! That was not good. Don't kill me. Oh wow! We barely survived that. Just stay back far when he does this, and you should be fine. Okay. Son of a gun. I'm trying to get that full combo, and it's screwing me up. 
Where am I? Throw me through the damn wall of the world. Oh god. Nope. Ah! Oh wow. I was just freaking iframing all of that. Just let me heal, you bastard. Being much more aggressive than usual, is isn't he? Maybe it's just in my head. Boom. Okay. And there we have it. Finally, Slave Knight Gale goes down. Sorry for the no commentary, but I just found out it was going better without me talking, basically. And it took me a long freaking time, like half an hour of fighting him over and over again. So what did we get? We got the Soul of Slave Knight Gale and the Blood of the Dark Soul. 120,000 souls, not too bad. Huh, <sighs> that was pretty hectic. 
I'm gonna have to, I've got so many deaths to cut in. I think I'm only gonna cut in about maybe five of them <laughs> and leave all the other ones out. It's just that first phase was kind of uh, wonky. Sometimes it was very easy, sometimes it was very hard. I'm not really sure what was going on there. But uh, what we want to do now is... I want to go to the Painted World because he kept talking about his lady and I want to make sure... Where was it? This one. I want to make sure uh, we're not supposed to give it to her for something. Maybe we'll get a painted weapon. <laughs> I know these are separate DLCs, but he spans both of them, so it's not completely out of the question. She, last time we saw her, I think she was up here scratching something into a table. No, she is gone now. Um... Let's try where Elfrida was. Oh wait, hold on. Check the balcony. I didn't check the balcony. Nada. Something died, thank you. Oh yeah, that Corvian goes to town on all those little Corvians. Okay, let's travel to the chapel now. Is it the cleansing chapel? No, just the Ariandel Chapel. Because remember, there was a painting in the attic here, too. Or here, which is, might be, it might be a place where she is. Considering she's supposed to paint something with this blood. Wasn't aware you could just eat through the Dark Soul and get the Dark Soul. Makes sense, though. Why is it all still on fire, though? Not very safe for you to be up here late. <laughs> She's just up here surrounded by fire. That must be a bug. Talk. Ashen one, thy gift of flame has taken root, and Uncle Gale will soon bring the pigment. Pigment, colored like the dark soul of man. I think I got something for you. My thanks, Ashen One. With this, will I paint a world? Please tell me thy name. I would name this painting after thee. Uh, let's do the painting of Trissau. My thanks. I will paint a world of that name. It will be a cold, dark, and very gentle place. Only one of those is a good and thing. Day, <laughs> it will make someone a goodly home. I thought that was Gwyn at first. Kind of looks like him still. I wonder when Uncle Gale intends his return. Uh, I never. hope the new painting will be to him a gentle home. I had to kill him My to get the stuff. I will of a one. Really? We didn't get anything? Well, then what was the point? It's supposed to give me an awesome weapon or something. Give me your paintbrush. I'll break it into a shiv or something. Let's go down here just, just to be sure. Anything down here? Let's go talk to that statue. It looks uh, oddly out of place. Or not out of place, but oddly uh, suspicious. Nope. All right, well, I guess that's it. Frida's still on fire down here. Is that Frida? No, that's a statue. <laughs> um, but uh, all right, well, that's where we're going to end it today. Hopefully, uh, I did okay on the final boss of the DLCs. Uh, we've only got probably one more episode to go, and it won't be a long one because we just have to kill the Soul of Cinder, Lord of Cinder, the, the Cinder dude that we've already fought once. He was pretty easy, too. Compared to Gale, I don't expect to have much trouble, so... We will see you guys next time, so please leave a like or comment below, and feel free to subscribe for more full Let's Plays like this one. And that's my mama. <laughs>